Yo, we're back, and uh, this is our new series, Command and Conquer 3 Tiberium Wars! <sighs> Alright, enough of that shit. Uh, yeah, we're gonna take a break from Mario Hex, and we're gonna go off and on on them, so, you know, we're gonna get on to Command and Conquer. Uh, Command and Conquer is a great game, great series, and it's an RTS game, so real time, all that good stuff. Usually missions you take about like 15 to like a half an hour, but um, I'll cut them and put in clips and just see what happens, you know? But um, I really want to get on it, and uh, we're gonna do the GDI mission, and we're using a hack. It's called um, Command uh, the Tiberium Wars Advance, you know, Command and Conquer Advance, whatever you want to call it. But um, it, it's a it's it alterates everything in it. Most mods do. Look it up on moddb.com. It'll tell you a lot of information. Right now, the video right now is just explaining what's going on, what happened in the past and getting you up to date because this this is like a it's a big distance between type I think it's what was the recent game it was uh Tiberium Wars uh, you know you know Tiberium Sun there we go Tiberium Sun it, yeah since that game it's 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 been um it's been different you know so go ahead and watch this real Take advantage of the chaos to recruit members and disguise their military infrastructure. Nazi and the crazy thing is, in those pictures, units don't even look like that. It's crazy. Determined to accelerate the spread of Tiberian, believing it is the catalyst for the next stage of human evolution. However, in recent years, the Brotherhood has been suspiciously quiet, with little terrorist. And people, people, this this game has been out since like '03, so. Not even 03, 08, and it's been a long time. I think this is the same year when Fallout came out. There's a lot of good games that came out that year, but um, yeah, it's it's been a minute. It's been a minute, and uh, the the mods that take place now that that alterate, you know, the original game. It's pretty cool, you know. It's like a hack on like on Mario, but it's a different game, and you know, and all that. But here we go, prologue. Now you know what? Screw that. This is gonna take too much time. You know, shut up. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I actually wanted to get out of that because um, it takes a long time. If you really want to look at the the videos and all that, you know, might as well do it. But um, and this game, it's it's bit it's a bit old. It's Greetings, a bit Commander. Old. This is GDI Battle Command here to get you up to speed on some of the ground operations for this mission. Everything's running pretty smoothly. And yes, you got to use the keyboard, and yes, a mouse, and all that good stuff. We got our, our rifleman squad. Put them in this building. Shut up. Alright. Waiting for these guys to come around. Yeah, usually they just kill them, but um... Let's see what happens. Uh, and it's lagging up. There we go. Super video. Look like they're doing the job. It's good to know. Yeah, um, recording, it, it's, it takes a bit out of it, but, um, I think I got all the settings right so I could record just right, so let's see. Everything's going decent. Your harvester will automatically seek it out. Once the harvester is full or the field is depleted, the harvester will return and begin refining the Tiberium. Yeah, so let's get on with it. Alright, it's telling you... Oh no, we got to wait for this. This is the mobile construction. It'll allow you to construct various and all that. And, um... Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> Girlfriend, crazy. Anyways, yeah, I got the mobile uh, construction vehicle. But, uh, MPCV, you know, whatever. Uh, you know... It's, I love this game. I played this game relentlessly. This game itself, because there's so many mods that alterate this game, and it just, I loved it. I, I can't stop playing it. And right now, me doing a video now for it. It's, it's legit. You know, I like it, and um, I'm gonna just keep on and keep going with it. You know what I mean? Something wrong with the uh, Command and Conquer? I think Command and Conquer did a great time until EA came in and fucked everything up. That's my opinion. If you don't like it, well, you know, that's that. Deploy here. Yeah, I know EA did part of this, pretty much this game, but like, New construction options. when it came, I guess when it came down to Tib Tiberium Twilight, the the, the Command and Conquer 4, uh, I heard it just it just didn't do units. great. 
I didn't like Multiple it. Structures of the same type I was pretty upset about that, and I was just like, wow, you know, it just ruined, it just ruined my childhood game. Rifle squad ready. But you know, I still play this one, and I still, I like, I still like uh, Red Alert Three. If you know what Red Alert Three, it's a different universe, but it's still fun. They had like three universes in this in this Command and Conquer series, and that was pretty cool. I thought that was unique, because usually most um, series don't do that. You know what I mean? Training. Training. So, rifle squad ready. Let's get this Objective going. Complete. Rifle squad Round ready. Support. We already built all the units, and they're building rifle more and more and more. Ready. Usually, I just do that, just spawn units right here. But Enemy I like units. to go strate strategically. Jesus Christ! There we go. Oh no, they're dead, and Commander, my guys are dead. That fucking power. sucks. And uh, power. yeah, it Build sucks. A power plant from your production tab. All right. Build a power plant, cool. But we gotta turn off power, you know. Ah, uh, this is yeah. This is gonna be popping up a lot. These tutorial the missions, they're they're we really like that. They the suck. Power so free up more power. we're just gonna this have to deal with the rest of your base to continue functioning. To do this, click on the lightning bolt Alrighty. button at the top of your command bar. Then click on a structure. Only structures that require power can be turned off. You may need to turn off more than one structure in order to meet Alrighty. your power requirements. And actually, you know, I was thinking about doing those uh, those cutscenes. I actually was thinking about just doing a video about that and just show every cutscene at the end, you know, when we finish up. Because they do have a, well like a, a theater the so you can watch all of them. Located on the left side of the mini map indicates that your but, uh, base now has enough yeah, let's power. Let's turn this back on. Mm, you know, let's, let's not repair that. Oh, you know, fuck off. Battlefield expanded. Oh, that's just great. Repair. I'm gonna repair that and I'm gonna turn this back Command. on. It seems Nod has noticed us. They're sending a yeah, this this mod base. actually lets you because uh, of the command post. Um, you upgrade your turbines through this, so tab. yeah, it's good. New bonus objective. We have a watchtower, pretty much uh, for anti for anti infantry, whatever. Unit under attack. Lift all of them attack. Yeah, this is this is basic stuff right now, but for right, for right now until um, we get to leader levels. And look at that, all my guys are all fucked up, but it's all good. That I'm sending reinforcements now. Incoming transmission. Fucked up. They're bleeding. They're bleeding. I say. And um, bring some more watchtowers for this. Missile squad reinforcements have arrived. New yeah, we got missile squads now. Build those real quick. On account of the Nod presence, additional squads of missile soldiers have been requisitioned. There we go. They're effective against structures. Yeah, the, these watchtowers do pretty good. But uh, yeah, everything's been good today. I'm um, about to head to work in probably like maybe 30, 40 minutes. So I just want to do this one quick video for this. You know, and this is like all your intel stuff. It gives you all the information about your units. Uh, if they're all unlocked, well, the reason why is because I already defeated this game, so they're all there. So um, that just that was just a, guess, uh, a good glimpse of it. And uh, we got one more guy, I guess. Yep. Need this thing to rebuild and all that good stuff. But I think that's enough. Keep your weapon ready. Let's, let's just go ahead and destroy them all. Securing area. Unit under attack. Depending on the, what difficulty, um, they will the the AI, you know, the enemies, they will be they will attack a lot harder and a lot stronger. So the more smarter ways, you know, at least. But um, that was that, you know. And we're gonna save these buildings right here for a second. I got all these guys over here. Those are engineers. Further investigation of the area is needed. All right, let's Engineer capture these buildings. Engineers have two important functions. First, they can repair structures and bridges. Second, they can capture enemy structures and tech buildings, allowing you to control enemy structures. looking good. Let's move over here. To do this, so gotta let this um and then right harvester on the structure you know, gather, to repair gather new bonus objective. fucking Tiberium and all that crap. Engineers are not combat units and cannot protect uh, themselves. All right, now this, I'm only gonna be talking like this for like this only this video because this is a tutorial video. Um, there's more there's more tutorials to it, but like there's like mini ones, and I'm not gonna really give too much shit about it. I'm gonna be like real casual, and then the, when I game on and all that stuff. So whatever. Right now we're gonna kick ass though in a bit. Training. I need two of those, and uh, I'll tell you the reason why in a little bit. In. And I pretty much know the inside and out I for the most missions. Uh, some of them I do forget. Some of them, you know, I don't. So you know. I got their codes. Everything's ready. 
Yeah, we need nice this guy. To repair that bridge, that's one of our objectives, whatever. Am I covered? And uh, we're gonna move over there. Yep. Any time now, Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is the, that's the problem with them. They they take forever. But look at the look at the little the little little things they could do, like disarm vines and then repair a building. And this is like a civilian building, I think. Yeah. Yeah, it's civilian building. It's all good. All right. Now this one, this one's gonna be ready. over Objective here. Battlefield expanded. We're gonna repair that fucking. We're gonna we're actually we're gonna capture it, you know, whatever. But um. Reporting in. We're gonna take that, but but I think I should build some more guys. Training, new bonus objective. Training. Missile squad ready for combat. Missile Building squad captured. ready for combat. Bonus objective complete. Move Missile these guys over here. I am getting resources now, and uh, the original one it actually gave you like 10 or like 15 or something like that. Now it gives you like 25 because uh, the guys who made the mod, you know, is, you know, made it like that. But whatever. Oh yeah, and I think we gotta sell one of these buildings. Yeah, the guys, it's all good. And that's that, so we're gonna select everybody with Q, we're gonna hit the aggressive stance, and we're gonna move on. Oh, no. Attack move. Alright, so we're gonna hit this up over Enemy here. Combat zone. There we go, that's like a little battalion right there, I guess you could call it, you know. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, they're going hard and they're going pretty good right now, so they're doing good. Pretty good right now. But while they're doing that, um, probably gonna build some more guys. Oh, look at that! Airfield. Shut up. Yeah, it just unlocked right now. I guess. Yeah, it's part of that little tutorial mission. You know. What I mean? you know. Because even though, you know, it's real funny because they even have a boot camp, and I remember that. And the PC and the the console versions are different, but they're kind of the same thing. Unit and um, you know, you know they they are real options. tutorials, and those will give you like the insides and outs of every unit. Not every unit, but like you know things that people you know will do and all that stuff. Yeah, but um, these guys suck. They're dying quick. And it looks like these guys didn't make it, so it's all good. So what we're gonna do is build one of these. Get any power. And we're gonna build it right there. Get the upgrade. Upgrade in progress. Shit, that thing took damage. That sucks. And. Uh, Construction complete. Alrighty, I think we need a Tiberium silo. That is pretty much that carries your resources and all that crap, so. Building. Building in progress. Training. Training. Construction complete. Alright, this usually takes a while because the fact the resources will run Cannot out. Deploy here. Bonus already build it. Ready for lift off. Yeah, Walker, building, ready for lift I'm building off. all these guys right now. These are hammerheads. These are from like King's Wrath. That's another game, and I'm probably gonna do that one, but like on standard version. You know. Walker, ready for Walker, lift off. Ready for Okay, that's all. As far as much I need right now, and I'm gonna just build these couple guys, and we're gonna put these guys. Well, they don't have a wave point, so it's whatever. And I'm gonna put like rocket men or missile squads, whatever you want to call them. Hammerhead put them right there. Line. Yeah, hammerheads are pretty cool because the helicopters, but they do upgrade, I think. Nah, no, they don't actually. There's no upgrade for them. It just, just that it sucks. But yeah, uh, once you put like a unit inside, uh, they attack ground and air. That's the cool thing. It depends. It depends on the unit though too. Um, but um. 
I don't know, but I really do like um, these hammerheads. These guys are awesome. You know, they're worth getting. But um, there's other units in here, like like these guys, Zone Raiders. These are pretty good. They attack air and um, and uh, land. You know, but um. Just wait and see, you know what I mean? Heavy gun ship bear. Alright, we're gonna yes, get sir, these right guys, we're gonna you put, you know, an aggressive stance and move these. Closing in. You know. Take it out. Yeah, these guys actually shoot bullets as well. Enough of that. Uh, let them destroy these guys real quick. Yeah, I forgot these extra shoot Gatling guns while in the in the original game. It didn't. They didn't do that, so. Yeah, so that's like non stop barrage of like missiles and all that stuff. And I like them, it's pretty cool. Yeah, these guys, these guys are pretty legit. I like them. Take those guys out. Free fire. Establish down. They're complaining, oh it's too big. Don't send you in, you know, they're gonna all gonna die and all that crap. And I'm like, you know, we're not. And I usually that comes up when that and all that. So we're almost out of here. You're letting you have the Select target. ion cannon. And I'm just gonna sacrifice my men, so you know, we're gonna get that done. Sorry guys, um, we'll see you next time with these. But usually this is a big beam. It's pretty cool, super weapon. Boom! They're done. And that was legit. That was awesome. Usually, it's that building right there. Ah, oh, I can't point it, but... It's that broken building that looks all black out, but you know what I mean. So now, Commander. it's more cutscenes, no, and I'll do these in a later time, so I really don't give a damn about the cutscenes. And it only took like 15, 14 minutes, something like that. You know, all it tells you like a little like like a debrief of the mission and all that crap, and they tell you all oh, what you did and what you didn't do and all that stuff. This is all the good stuff, all the bad stuff, and it's all good. And um, more, more cutscenes, and this is the next one. So until next time, we'll be doing this uh, mission. So peace out, guys.